Welcome back to episode two of Hades. On the previous episode, we died about a bajillion times, but we're learning, so that's what's important. So as we uh, play this game and we get better and better each time, then hopefully we'll uh, start to make it a little bit further on each playthrough. All right, so press LB to open. He gave me a codex. All right, so this one, here's some multi-headed hound of hell is really not so bad as this deserved reputation. All right, and it says learn more by having a conversation with Cerebus. Okay, and then I've got one for uh, for this. Earn more by entering House of Hades. Learn more by entering Tartarus. Okay, this is cool. And I got ones for Zeus and Athena, Hades, Nyx. All right, cool. So every time I have conversations with each of these things, I'm going to, uh, to get some other information and stuffs, right? Um, and then what was the thing that I could do with the keys earlier? That might've been over in my room. I don't remember. All right, we'll, we'll go check that out. All right, let's have a conversation with you. All right, well, you might learn a thing about freaking breath mints, dude. Okay. All right, what kind of renovations can we get going here? Got great hall, west hall, lounge, bed chambers, ayo, court music. Okay. All right, so there's a lot of things that you can upgrade in this. I still haven't figured out where the healing fountain is. I'm going to need to find that damn thing. And I forgot where I could spend my freaking coins. Or, uh, not coins, but the, um, uh, freaking keys. Hey, yeah, thanks, Nix. Good old Stevie Nix. Always on the case. Um, alright, so let's see. It wasn't in here. Oh, wait, hold on. I can, I can upgrade these things, too. Deal bonus attack and special damage. Uh, restore a small amount of your health when you exit a chamber. Plus one per rank. Okay. That's good. I need that. Uh, death Defiance. Restore 50% health instead of dying when your life total is depleted. Ooh, one time per rank. Nice. All right. Those are some good boosts, man. Okay, unlock new talents. So for five keys, I can unlock new talents with the keys. All right. But there was something else that I could do with those keys. I got to remember where that was. It wasn't in here, was it? Well, maybe it was. Yeah, it was here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I can unlock this. What is this thing? Oh, it's a bow. All right. Freaking heck yeah, dude. Oh, look. Yeah, all right. Yeah, I want to... Yeah. My name is Karen, and I want to talk to your supervisor. Okay. If you insist. Wait, I said that. <laughs> LB updated. Okay, there's Skelly. Animated Skelly and I. We seldom get along. He's too talkative for me and spouts such simple condensation. Condescensions as uh, to all those in earshot. Okay. He seems like a dick. Let's murder him. So you can shoot fast, but the longer you hold it, the more powerful it does, or what? That was 60, 44. So yeah, if you shoot fast, you get less damage out of it. I'm trying to teabag you, but it wouldn't let me. Sad about it. Press Y to volley far. Oh, that's dope. All right. That's pretty awesome, dude. I kind of enjoy that. That's awesome, man. This reminds me, uh, if you guys ever played Fantasy Star Online, there was a gun called the Spread Needle. And this thing kind of reminds me of that when you do the volley mode like that. That's awesome. You can hit for some serious damage with the volley on that. That's pretty cool. All right. So, what does this thing do? Doesn't tell you what those things are. All right, we'll have to experiment with those. All right, so let's get out. I don't guess I can switch back and forth between the bow and the uh, sword. That makes things kind of complicated. All right, so each time we come here, we're going to get uh, some sort of upgrade, I guess. All right, so maybe now we should go and do the, uh, the chain lightning. Oh, crap. I need to be way smarter when it comes to my attacks. The, the bow is a little dangerous, dude. <laughs> oh, the bow is a little dangerous for uh, for the way that I play, man. Oh, crap. This allows me to keep range, though, which would be good. If you really think about it. This can unlock something back home. Okay, so we can go that way or we can go this way. Let's give this a shot. All right, so when I go through here, I should gain a little bit of HP as well. We're at 34 now. Gotta dodge too, man. If I don't dodge, I'm gonna have a bad time. Woo! 
coin. I'll just take that. Yes, indeed, I will. Okay. Now we're going to go through here. Dude, this game is great. <laughs> I freaking love this game. Yeah, it's a blast. Holy crap, dude. <laughs> dude, so good. <laughs> this is so much better. <laughs> This is so much better than going hand to hand, like right up in people's faces, dude. Oh, two for one sale. Oh, dodge that. There we go. Dude, this is much better. All right. So we're sitting at 36 on our health. So I think we should be at 38 when we come through here. Yes. All right, cool. So the more I can upgrade that, the better things are going to be for me in terms of my healing as I go through chambers, which is, oh God, a good thing. Oh, dodge. Ugh. Oh, crap. All right, what was this? All right, we only lost one HP there. Athena, why you wield Koronok the Heat Seeker. I never took you for an archer, though the power of that bow is undeniable. Use it wisely, thank you. All right, so we got Phallic Shot. Uh, you cast damage to foes in a small area and can deflect. Bronze skin, resist damage from foe's attack. It's only 5% damage resistance. Holy shield, after you take damage, damage foes around you and briefly defect, deflect. Ooh, okay. Um, Let's do... So this one, uh, press B for a powerful range attack. Retrieve your uh, damage, your cast to keep using it. All right. I didn't even use my cast at all in, that, uh, in these first few areas here. All right, so we should be at 39 health when we come through this door. Uh, the less damage we take, the better, ultimately. Oh, that is dope as hell. Oh, crap, until I, until I got blasted there. Oh, jeez. I got my ass beat right there, dude. Holy crap. Jeez, what are these guys hitting me with? Good lord. Oh no, I jumped right on the freaking... I jumped right on the thing, dude. That was a bad move, but we had the uh, the special skill there that we had gotten. Oh, jeez. Good lord, that was just stupid on my part. <laughs> that was so bad. I dashed right onto that trap, too, man. Alright, so we'll be up to 29 health now since we got our... Oh no, okay, we didn't get that. We went through there for whatever reason, but all right. Oh crap, we got a bunch of these dudes. Oh crap, that hurt. Whew. All right, wave one complete. Damn it. <laughs> oh man, I am really not great at this game, but I am having a blast playing it, so that's all I care, man. I don't know. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Shut up, Hades. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Yeah, everybody's dead. Give him a break, Dad. <laughs> All right, so we can upgrade Shatter Presence. I kind of want to hold off and get some more uh, Chthonic Vitality, I guess is how you say that. We need to go earn some more of those. What's up, dumbass? Okay, so we're going to stick with the bow. All right, we're going to do so much better this time, right? Because I am not going to lose a bunch of HP right off the bat to stupidness. All right. Your power shot is easier to execute and deals 150% damage. Your attack deals 200% damage to distant foes. Twin shot. Your attack fires two shots side by side, but has reduced range. But we need the range to stay up, I think. Even though a double shot sounds nice. Um, we want to keep distance on our foes. So I don't know how much distance that is. Or we could just go, yeah, all right. Um, all right, so hold X and release when you see a brief flash, okay. Press or hold X to use your main weapon. Okay. The deadliest bow of all. Beautiful. Each time the okay, let's go. You. Frickin' nailed him. Okay. 
Okay, another key. Let's do it. Dude, this game's fun. I just want to play it all the time now. Oh, that hurt. That's not good. That guy with some of that fun stuff. Missed and hit the wall. <laughs> Oh yeah. Okay, options here. Oh, okay. This is some of the stuff that we saw on the other thing. Let's do this route just to have something different. Oh, crap, that hurts. Knock that off, shard boy. Okay. All right, nice. Now. All right, so we get five gemstones. Uh, this one's different. Let's try this one. Damn, quit hitting me from across the damn map, dude. Ooh, crap. This guy hurts. Sheesh. Oh, crap. Whew. Must be a mess. Let's see here. Hi there. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Why, hello, hello there. Hello, hello. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. Yeah? I'm interested. What, what are we talking here? Okay, your attack deals more damage and inflicts weak. Status curse for at least four seconds. Victim deals at least 30% less damage. Press Y for your weapon's unique attack for Heartbreak Flourish. For at least four seconds, victim deals 30% less damage. You know what? Let's do that. All right. Should we go and get some life essence here? <laughs> Let's get some range here. Grab that. And that back over. There we go, baby. Hell yeah. Gemstones. Wretched Witch. Yeah, all right. Cool, cool. Game is uh, it's a little terrifying at times, man. You get low on health, and you're like, oh, God, I'm going to die, you know? And that sucks. <laughs> and that sucks. Woo. All right, so Heartbreak Flourish now levels up. Special damage is increased even more. Crap, that freaking hurts, dude. Those are a pain in the ass, man. Crap. Oh, crap. Down to 9 HP. Guess we just gotta try and survive, dudes. With 11 HP. Alright. Well, we can uh, buy a McRib. So, oh. Alright, well, I guess I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> okay. Go with that. Buy a McRib. I can't buy that one. What's up, bro? Alright, you too, buddy. Keep up the good work. Okay. Let's get this going here. I thought I'd find you here. Oh crap, is this a boss fight? Oh no. Got their attention. Okay. Get that going. Do this. Gotta keep moving. Alright. Got that back. Send that out. Okay. Oh crap. Been moving off there, dude. It's stuck in a place I didn't want to be there. Just a bit longer. Gotta survive now. Yeah, sucking nerds. 
Holy crap. That was intense as hell, dude. All right. So again, I don't know what this thing means. I know what this thing means, so continue on this path here. Holy crap, that was intense, dude. Is that like a nest? I gotta get that. Okay, there we go. Oh, crap. Not where I wanted to be right there, dude. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many of them, dude. <laughs> I'll do a trap, dumbass. Whoo-wee. Alright. Passion dash. Empty inside. Your weak uh, effects have longer. Okay, it's the last an extra five seconds. Powerful ranged attack. Alright. No love without pain. Ooh, nice. Okay, I like this. Okay. Let's go this way. I think this is the longest I've survived. <laughs> this uh this looks shady. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, we can get another key. I don't know what this thing is. It's a power up, but I don't know what it is. Always a pleasure, Charon. Okay. So I can go from level two to level three for Heartbreak Flourish. Let's do this. Let's get that cast damage up. Oh crap. It's Connor McGregor. Or something like that. Oh crap. We're gonna get our asses beat. <laughs> This is going to not be great because we don't have uh, any health. <laughs> All right, death defied, so that's good news. Because otherwise, we're about to have a bad time, you know? Uh, we're still going to have a bad time. I have no health at all, dude. No health at all. And she's summoning friends. Yeah, we got our asses beat. Holy crap, that was rough. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, that's going to wrap up for this episode. I will see you guys back again tomorrow with another one. Thank you guys for hanging out on the couch watching me play this game. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button, hit subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Y'all have a great day.